Hello my friends. Today I ain't gonna make a long video today. I just wanna let you know how to tell if your radio has a bad power supply. As you know, this radio I've been working on here for a while. I've done a lot of work to it. And now I come to find out that the power supply is weak, too. Which is no surprise. I mean, it's a 30-year-old radio. It's probably been cranked up its whole life. So I just want to show you how to tell if your power supply is bad without taking anything apart. I'm going to turn off this light. I'm going to plug the radio in. Now, as you see, there's a light right there, the power light. When you have batteries in the radio, this light right here lights up, and then as you turn up the music, the light will get dimmer as the batteries die. That's how you tell your battery power. Once that light goes out or starts to get really dim, you know your batteries are dead. Now, I have this plugged into the wall right now, and as soon as I turn up the music, that light gets really dim. Now, yeah, the music still plays, but you see how the light dims out. Let me zoom in a little closer so you can see. All right, I'm going to turn this up real loud. Now, keep your eyes on that light. See that? After I turn it up past three, that light goes to that light goes completely out after I turn the volume past three. And as you can see, the volume on this radio goes all the way up to about, well, no numbers, but once you turn it past there, three o'clock or nine o'clock, whatever you want to call it, after you put it past there, the light goes out. Now, if your radio doesn't have a power light or have a meter, then that's a little different. It's hard to test if you don't have a light or a meter to tell. It's another reason why I don't like this new modern junk that they sell because they don't give you meters. They don't give you any extra uh, uh, plugs on the side. They don't, you, basically, you can't really work with the new stuff. That's why I don't like it. I like the old stuff that you can fiddle around with and it has meters and stuff. So if there's something wrong, you can diagnose it a lot easier. But... That's how you tell if your power supply is bad. If you don't have a light, well, all I can say is turn up the volume. And if you get distortion uh, before the knob reaches halfway, chances are either your power supply is starting to go or your transistor is starting to go. But, uh, yeah, that's how you test your power supply. 